This is a demonstration for Laurie and Bruce on how to copy a CD using Windows Media Player and put it on their iPod using Copy Trans Manager. Open up Windows Media Player. We've already set up the defaults being um, put in the CD. It will find the CD and put in the track names and cover art and so on. If, it's, if the CD you have doesn't come up with those details, you need to type them in manually and copy and paste a cover into the cover section if you want that on, to show up on your iPod. Um, by default, I've already had this in the machine before, by default it just shows the album name and the first thing here, the artist and so on. Um, because I've had this open before, I've already typed in the album artist a space a dash so that all albums by that artist end up being together in the iPod rather than uh, scattered around by the first letter of their album title. Okay, settings, we've got the format set up as MP3, audio quality 192 is fine for the iPod and I've told it to eject the CD after ripping. Normally I'd rip the entire CD but um, as this is just an example, we're just going to do, say, the first three tracks and go rip CD. See over here it says ripping. Um, it will copy to whatever folder you've set up in settings. Um, it says where it goes to. In my case, I've got um, C drive user Windows uh, Music, Windows Media Player. I think on yours I created a folder called um, Copied from CD. But when I open up my music folder, I'll see a folder called Windows Media Player, and that's where it's going to put where it's going to put it on my computer. So. Copy two tracks. One more in this demo, just, just to give us an idea. Plug in your iPod, open up, open up Copy Trans Manager, and you've got a start screen that just says start, just press start, and it will show you all the contents of the iPod as it is at the moment. So open up open up Copy Trans Manager. As I say, I've already got this open. Um, you can see that under the albums, Keith Urban's not currently there. Open up my uh, file manager or and go to music. In mine, it's in Windows Media Player. There's the album here the, under the artist, and then the title, and there are the tracks. I would then just drag this album over onto the iPod in Copy Trans. You'll see it adding tracks to adding tracks to the playlist. If I look at my albums, there it is. There. Um, normally, it'd be the whole album. There they are. And I just need to click on Update to update the iPod. So click on Update. I could then go on and do more albums or I could do a whole bunch of albums and then just drag them all in at once. It doesn't matter which way which way I do it, but it says updates complete. If I'd finished with the iPod, um, just hit eject. And it's all done. It's on the iPod ready to play.